Hi everyone, today I'm going to do a review of my Chanel Classic Long Wallet. So, this came in this pouch, suede like material, and it's an envelope style dust bag or pouch. And this wallet with this dust bag is inside this beautiful hard case box. I got all my Chanel handbags and wallet in, at the boutique in um, downtown. And when you guys purchase your Chanel, either a wallet or a handbag like this, make sure you ask for extra camellia flower because you guys can do a lot of things with a camellia flower. Okay, now on to the review. So this is the wallet, burgundy color. Um, this is the hardware. I'm not sure what they call this color of hardware, but it's not gold. Uh, more of like a pewter color. It's shiny, but it's not silver. Just like the classic bag, it has the pocket over here. Let me measure these the length is about seven inch and a quarter by four and a half inches and it's really thick about an inch and a half It opens up like this. And it's trifold. One, two, and three. It has the uh, pocket for your bills. Pocket over here for your coins. Another pocket over here, and one more pocket over there. This one has silver logo stamp that says Chanel, and this holds one, two, three, four, five, six credit cards. six of these. Now over time guys if you fold it like this put in your purse this will create dense markings on the letter on this flap and you don't want that. You want to protect your letter because this is lambskin this part this is patent lambskin and this is very delicate so what I do is cut out a piece of cardboard, kind of fold it like this, so it doesn't create that annoying dents over here. Or you can put a, like a piece of felt paper and you can put it on top. The thing is, when you're using this wallet, it gets annoying that you have to take this off, slide your card out, and then pay your bill. But, but then again, I don't want to 
leave some markings here or indentation so uh, I guess now it doesn't bother me anymore I have this wallet for about uh, let's see three months or so I think so this is pretty new it has the back pocket but I don't normally use this pocket over here it doesn't really fit anything other than receipts maybe now if you have this patent letter wallet you don't want another patent letter um, wallet or anything next to each other because over time the color from one item will transfer onto the other and vice versa so you don't want that so keep in mind if you have another patent letter goods items don't put them next to each other um, a lot of people complain about markings over here because it's pretty shiny so you can see fingerprints now nah, it doesn't really bother me and if it has a lot of fingerprints you just kind of you know clean it like this and it goes away mm. so since this long wallet is pretty big pretty long you can use this also as a clutch when you go to an evening um, dinner let me show you guys how I carry this like that for reference I'm only 5'1 I'm pretty short so this one looks okay I like this So let me compare the size of this one to my other uh, long wallet. This is an old Burberry one. This is thin, made out of wool material. Looks like that. So this is a bit longer, but thinner. another wallet this is by Louis Vuitton this is a French style wallet it's slightly thinner than this one same length this one is also from Burberry this is a zip around wallet. Looks like this. This is an old one as well. This is in um, textured letter and patent letter here. So if you have this kind of letter goods, you don't want them next to each other because they will get stuck together over time and the color will transfer but in terms of size this one is a tad longer a tad taller but slightly thinner and this is obviously not a wallet this is Louis Vuitton PM agenda shorter it can be the same um, thickness same height but this is way shorter compared to an iPhone this is iPhone 6 Plus. The iPhone is shorter. And I don't think you can 
I never tried guys but let me see no you can't compared to my small size Chanel handbag this is shorter this actually fits inside but once you put it inside this bag that's it you can't put anything else and if you want to see a video of this one you guys can check out my channel and click on the link all right there you go thanks for watching guys and have a good day now bye